Do you like to look up into the sky at night? Many people find looking at the stars and planets to be both relaxing and interesting. At nighttime, we can easily see the moon. We can also see the planet Venus without much difficulty. But do you know which planet is seen most easily at night after the moon and Venus? If you guess Jupiter, you are right. Jupiter is the fourth brightest object in the sky. Remember that the sun is the brightest. At night, it is the third brightest object. In fact, even the moons around Jupiter are visible at night. But you will need at least some binoculars to see these. If you have a small telescope, you can even see Jupiter's rings. I will talk about Jupiter's rings a little later in this lecture. Before we get into the details about Jupiter, let's talk about the planet's name. Jupiter was the name of a Roman god. He was the king of the Roman gods. Actually, Jupiter, the planet, was also called Jove. Jove was another name for Zeus, king of the Greek gods. But the Roman name stuck. I guess the Roman gods were more popular or something. Anyway, Jupiter is the king of the planets, so it makes sense that it's named after the king of the gods. Jupiter is the largest of all the planets. In fact, Jupiter is much larger than all of the other planets in the sky. Let's compare the size of Jupiter to our planet, the Earth. Jupiter's diameter is more than 11 times larger than the Earth's. Pretty incredible. Jupiter is over 11 times larger than the Earth. Can you imagine that? How about the weight of Jupiter? Scientists have found that Jupiter weighs more than 300 times the weight of Earth. That's right. I said more than 300 times the weight of Earth. Obviously, Jupiter is a colossal planet. Let's talk a minute about the composition of Jupiter. What do you think Jupiter is mainly composed of? Jupiter is mostly made up of gas. Gas planets do not have solid surfaces like we have on Earth. So we've got this big planet made up of gas, but it is 300 times heavier than Earth. Kind of mind-boggling. Now, what kind of gas do you think is found on Jupiter? Again, scientists have found the answer to that question. Jupiter is about 90% hydrogen. Of course, hydrogen is a very common gas. Jupiter also contains about 10% helium. So hydrogen and helium are the principal elements of the planet. I'll finish today with some information about Jupiter's rings. Remember that I mentioned them earlier? This was not discovered until recently when scientists sent satellites to study Jupiter. The images returned from this satellite showed that Jupiter has rings. At first, most tried to refute any claims that Jupiter could have rings like the planet Saturn does. But in fact, Jupiter does have rings, although they are smaller than and not as bright as the rings around Saturn. Unlike Saturn's bright rings, Jupiter's rings are dark. The rings of Jupiter are likely made up of very small pieces of rock. But like I said before, with a telescope, these rings can be seen by amateur observers.